Hello everyone. Another beautiful day here at Northumberland, a bit cold. And as you can see by the weather, it's a little bit uh, bit windy. And if you didn't see the sea there, I'm crap it. It's phone photography stuff. It's not one of my best things. Um as you should know, I've my um, I've got five days left of me banned on Facebook for posting a rune. Um Facebook seemed to put the foot down and say, well, I'm not going to, I'm not going to, um, let him win this appeal because he wins all these appeals. Well, you know, if any one of those appeals were worth anything, it's this one because badness for posting the room and I hadn't even posted, I was making a page about Nordic traditions in the banders because when I was building the page, I was going to post the rune. I had even put on Facebook. Anyway, as I said, it's the same rune as what they offer you on your, um, your profile frame. So everyone seems to know that now. I'm not going on about that anymore. What I'm going to go on about is I seem to talk a lot about um, ordinary rights and that's the true rights. Um, how we get sort of pushed out and ignored, which we do. I mean, most people don't even class it as a religion. Um, especially the police, they have, they have no class it as a religion. Um, so what I'm going to be doing in the next week or so, I'm going to be reaching out to the local pagan groups, Wicca, Witchcraft, um different groups like that, shamanic, and talk to them about, you know, working together to try and get more rights for us. Because according to the government statistics, we're only 0.4 of a percentage of this whole country's religions. And that's pathetic. I know a lot of witches, I know a lot of people, lots of pagans, I know a lot of heathens, and I know a very lot of Odinists. Um, so, you know, we, we need to have a voice heard more and let people know we're not 0.4% of the country's population. We're a lot more than that. Okay, so on Bank Holiday Monday, I'm going to be visiting uh, Jarrah Hall and I've got a, uh, a belt-in ceremony on with shamanic drums and stuff like that. I'm going to go down and visit them, see what we can do then. Um, I think as a whole, Odinus should be working more with other pagan groups. Um, and all Wicca and witchcraft and even satanic. If, if you look at the Satanist groups, most Satanist groups, part of their laws is you don't hurt anyone, you don't hurt children, you don't hurt animals, you don't fight in other people's wars because it's their wars, not yours. Um, you know... They used the word satanic to separate the self from the Christian church to see him outside the Christian church. Most of them will tell you straight away they don't believe in Satan, they don't believe in God, they believe in free will. Um, a lot of ordinance groups believe is they do what you will but don't hurt anyone. Um, most witches and paganists, Satanists, I know, are all animal lovers. Which, which we are, it's part of nature. Um, so, yeah, let's get all us nature worshippers back together and working with each other um, and try and stop all this big business that's destroying our countryside. Okay, then, have a really good day. Like I say, it's Bank Holiday Monday coming up in the UK, um, and I'll be attending Jarrah Hall. They've got a Saxon and Viking um, weekend planned. So hopefully I'll take a few photos of that. Okay, then everyone, all your brothers and sisters, I will say goodbye. And to my brother, Pouch. Thanks, bro, for the heart. I appreciate it. Okay, bye.